Wow, it feels like I haven't done this in a million years. Wow, I am so happy to be saying that again and to be back on YouTube. And I have something very exciting to share with you guys. I am launching my own brand, or better yet, my teaser collection. I would like to introduce to you my mini collection, Electric Dreams by Nahima Azor. This is just a taste of what you can expect from me in the future. I'm so excited to say that this collection will be launching Friday, July 9th. It's something that I've been working on for a few months now and I documented the entire process. Let's get into it. So ever since I was a little girl, it has always been a goal of mine to have a collection of my own. And also as a designer, constantly being inspired everywhere I go, I literally have sketchbook upon sketchbook filled with my designs. So I ought to share them with the world maybe. This combined with everything that has gone on this past year in my life, if you know, you know. I really needed something to work on and something that could be my own and that I had control over. Also in doing this, I really wanted to share my growing passion for sustainable fashion and to share my support of the slow fashion movement. Something I think is really, really important and isn't talked enough by designers. Having a deep love as well as being a part of an industry that can be so harmful to the environment sometimes is just so polarizing to say the least. I want to do what I love while also being responsible and conscious of the effects that what I create have on the environment and the world at large. This is why the fabrics that I'm using in this collection as well as my future collection will be made of natural fibers, recycled synthetic fibers, dead stock fabrics, as well as secondhand fabrics. In addition, when I was thinking of how I wanted to package this collection and ship it to you guys, I really tried to only use materials that were either going to be recyclable or compostable. And hopefully that would just be um, another effort at being better for the environment. And something that I've been doing for years now is saving all of my scraps from any of my projects that I've worked on, as well as from my work that I did working on this collection. It's something that I'll continue to do for years on end. And it's just an effort to be as little waste as possible. And I'm hoping for in the future, you guys might see a little cute zero waste line coming from me. And you'll know that you helped to contribute to materials not going to a landfill. So that's awesome, something I'm really excited for for the future. So if you guys have any products you would like to see zero waste items in, comment them down below. I know that there is so much more that I could do to be even more sustainable. And that's definitely something that I'm continuously going to keep on working. I truly believe if we each do as much as we can collectively, that impact is gonna be amazing. But just know that these pieces are all made by me with passion, care, hard work, determination, and of course, love all up and through this whole collection. And I hope you guys will feel that um, if you are kind enough to support me and get one of my products, I truly hope that you feel that in wearing my pieces. So speaking of this collection, you're probably wondering, what is it? <laughs> the title of this collection, like I mentioned, is Electric Dreams. So this collection is inspired by romance, a picnic under the stars, and the vibrant beauty found in being a free woman. This collection is more of a feeling and a color palette that I wanted to convey more than anything. I talk more about my design and inspiration process in part one of my collection series that I'll be having. And in this part, I'll be talking about sketching, fabrics, and literally everything that went into the inspiration behind this collection and that whole process. A lot of these videos in the series are gonna be a lot more vlog style, and I hope you guys like and enjoy that. Also, you guys should know that the pieces launching July 9th will be drop one of this collection because this is something that I plan to continuously add products to in the future so be on the lookout for that as well okay so i just want to show you guys a quick little snippet of a behind the scenes of me actually building the landing page that you guys can see in the description of this video the idea of a landing page is to give you guys something to go to 
to sign up for my email list. People who are signed up will get the first access to the products, which are super uber duper limited. Like I only have certain quantities of all the fabrics. Be the first to know when we launch. I love how I say we when it's literally just me, but I feel like, you know, a, like a professional brand, they, they, they always say like we, so I'm gonna say we. So if you guys wanna see what this landing page looks like all finished, check the link in the description and you'll see what it looks like fully built out. And I highly recommend signing up to the email list so that you guys are able to get that 25% off within the first 24 hours of my launch. Okay, let's finish this. When I was developing this brand and designing this collection, watching other designers as well as other entrepreneurs on YouTube was something that was extremely, like I can't even, extremely helpful for me. See, I knew the fashion side of things but getting that advice on how to run a small business effectively, especially from other business owners, was tremendously helpful. That is why I wanted to be sure to document the whole process of me designing this collection so that other designers can watch and learn from my mistakes and learn from my advice in the whole process. And I really just hope this is something you guys enjoy watching. So this will be a multi-part series where I show the design process, sewing, the behind the scenes of the photo shoot, as well as building the website and of course, launching the collection. I'm so excited for you guys to see this process and to follow along each step of the way. So be sure that you are subscribed to my channel and have post notifications turned on so that you are notified when part one of this collection series is posted. I'm so excited to be back on YouTube. It has been way too long and to be taking you guys on this journey with me. See you guys next time. Bye. Got my camera landscape. Got my background lights on. Makeup done, hair done. Glasses on or off? Off or on? Y'all know I like my glasses, but they be having Okay, let's get into it.